Good morning, everyone. Dr. Victoria Skirbo here speaking to you from the Seeds of Transformation Healing Center in Wareham, Massachusetts. We have another nine degree morning here on uh, Sunday, um, January 16th, 2022. And so you have me sitting in my chair in my room in my pajamas this morning. Sorry about that. So today we have the moon in Cancer. Of course, the Cancer moon is very sensitive moon. We can feel the uh, increase in feelings and emotions coming up as uh, tomorrow is uh, promises to be a very powerful uh, full moon in the sign of Cancer. So we can feel that energy of the moon growing, uh, our feelings coming to a head. And uh, we'll talk about that more specifically tomorrow, but that, that full moon does have um, Pluto in a conjunction to the sun. And actually today, the 16th, is when that is exact of a Pluto-sun conjunction. It starts a year-long synodic cycle that um, helps us to come to terms with um, our desires, um, unconscious as they may be. Uh, we're talking about our collective desire and our collective desire uh, can be one of self-governance, um, self-responsibility, and um, we will have an opportunity over the next week or so to really come face-to-face uh, -face with, um, on a certain level maybe, where we feel um, where we have no power or where we feel powerless, uh, or um, become aware of the depth of power that we have within us. And that depth of power really comes through our connection to our own soul. And um, this conjunction between the sun and, and Pluto helps us to connect to that. The synodic cycle is a year long, and so we're just planting seeds at this time. And um, this week promises to be um, a turning point for um, many things as things come to light, um, as uh, possible paths forward um, reveal themselves. Whether or not we take those paths and how we move through life is really our decision. Uh, sometimes you can't control what's happening around you, but you do always have um, agency over how you are going to respond to what happens around you. And that is a lesson I think that we're all gonna learn uh, through 2022. I have a lot of hope for 2022, actually. Uh, it is going to be quite challenging, but I think we're up to it. And I think we're ready. Um, you know, we've had an opportunity, some of us who've been lucky enough to just sort of sit back and see where everything is, uh, a little bit of a break. Uh, and even for those who haven't, uh, certainly challenges to what they're doing at the moment. So um, the path forward will become evident at some point. Uh, we will get a clue tomorrow with that, with that um, full moon and then, of course, we have um, the, the change of the nodes um, on the 18th. So, uh, and among other things, um, if you want to check out my week ahead video, um, I think I call it um, the astrology of January from the 15th to the 22nd, the big shift begins. I think that's what I'm calling it. So you can feel the shift within you and you will see the shift around you. Have yourself a great day. Like and subscribe, and I will see you again tomorrow. I'm going to get out today once it warms up a bit and uh, see if I can get you some nice views. Uh, it really is a beautiful day, um, but I wasn't quite ready to put on my, uh, my coat and my hat and my gloves. So forgive me for that. Taking Sunday slow. All right, guys, take care. Namaste.